What's happening everybody? Welcome to my YouTube channel. Scott Mendenhall here with another review of an amazing set of rails. We've got the brand new Steep and Deep from The Float Life. However, we didn't get these from The Float Life. We got them from one of the coolest shops known to man and it is found in Lubbock, Texas. We're gonna talk about well, how awesome these are and the shop where you should get all of your one wheel needs met. We're pretty stoked about those. Let's get it started. If you just got a one wheel, you need to do this with your friend. <laughs> Look at my friend helping me. We are coming from a review on this rail. This is the 357T Skeletons. Loved them, but they hurt our back feet. The clearance, all those things, go watch the review. It's really good, but those are gone, and we are now to the steep and deep steeps. All right, these are the newest and latest and greatest thing from the float life. They are creators of this. They have put so many thoughts behind the, the creation of these. Rails help you speed up in so many facets. Meaning, why would you want to change your rails? Maybe you don't want to take all the time to get your abilities to be better, so you're going to change the machines to help you get faster while your ability is growing. I'm a Joe, not a pro. We scale for life around here, and this allows me to cheat. Some cool features that are in there that I don't know how one wheel isn't doing this to the rails yet, but a lot of people talk about overheating issues. They have, at the Float Life shop, have come up with these little uh, grooves, if you would, that will allow air to travel in and then it pushes it towards your hub, which would cool down your one wheel. So I like that little bit of ingenuity into the rails that would provide a little coolant to my hub. I think the added feature of being lower to the ground is going to give you a lot more stability and allow you to really get into those turns and then float just like Float Life intended it to. The packaging of said Float Life rails is slick. It's very, very small box. It's about 10 inches wide. It comes with the rails in it. Rob and family down there in Lubbock, Texas sent us the steep and deep saying you need to try this when they watch the review on this. Thank you to you guys. What we would love for you as a viewer, go give them some love. You can go straight on your phone. You can order almost all of the gear that you would want for your one wheel. You, uh, let me just read the message to Hey Scott, my name's Rob, and I was the guy on YouTube commenting, telling you, you should try the Steep and Deeps. I have a small business in Lubbock, Texas called Float World. Website is onewheelfloat.com. Well, I was wondering if I could send you a set. The answer was absolutely. But in return, we want to help this community down in Lubbock, Texas feel some love. So the next time you need to order some product, you go to their website and you order any flow product you want, plus so much more. There's one thing we did in a modification that you can choose to do or not. At the filming of this video, the WTFs do not have deletes, fenders, or anything. So you're gonna leave it exposed. Some people like that. It has reminiscent looks of an XR. I like the delete. I cut my delete. To make it more finished off as a product, at the moment, I just cut my delete, which Cutting the delete allows it to still remain as a finished product. I measured two inches from here. That's a two inch and just cut it with a Zolzol so you can still keep the W look, but it finishes off. It'll keep debris from getting into your battery, into your controller. Thank you, Rob from Flow World. This is awesome. Time to go mob.
dead honest. What an upgrade! Oh my gosh, like I'm out in the middle of nowhere, riding, screaming, it's an upgrade. Uh, on the tilt side of things, I left it to where I had it already tilted for the 357 skeletons, and I kind of like it. I don't feel the back leg lifting as high. I definitely lost a little clearance. Oh man, you feel locked in? You know what? I, I was thinking as I was riding around in here, I don't think I will put on any overlanders or uh, my control freak. I think gone are the days of those for me as well, at least for a while, because I just felt it felt so natural coming from board sports, snowboarding and from skateboarding, this style of rail makes me feel like that. Oh, your next order, your next order of any one wheel product that you want, will you go to onewheelfloat.com. They are a small business in Lubbock, Texas that would love some love. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, why are you still listening to this and you haven't done that thing? Subscribe to this video. We do tons of one wheel content all the time. If you wanna hang out with us on Sunday mornings on our other channel, we'll put the link down in the description as well. There'll be heaps of links to their website and how you can order stuff from the onewheelfloat.com or Float World. You can go there or you can hang with us on Sunday mornings whatever you can decide you want to go there right now and see what we do on Sunday mornings be our guest I promise you this you go there we'll make your life better and make you better at life everyone else have a fabulous day this one is sadly oh. you know the crazy thing when I'm ending this I still haven't wrote them this is just the outro so we could get to building it but at this point I still have no idea what it's like to ride this thing isn't that wild